Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be the fall favorites tag. Um, Jacqueline and then Manny and then Kathleen have done this tag from what I've seen. I know that Jacqueline Hill was the one that pretty much started it and it was a really fun tag and some of you asked me to do it so here it is. Mine might be not as cool as them. But I'm just going to talk about my fall favorites and things like that. So let's get started with pregunta numero uno. So the first question is, your, what is your favorite fall candle? I used to burn candles here in my house, but I stopped burning candles because down where I live or, you know, the little space that I have, it's very narrow and I don't have a lot of room. Plus, I have a toddler. I have a two-year-old, and she's very, very curious. So it just scares me to have candles around. But what I do love is anything that has to do with these, like, Febreze, um, the Air Effects. When they launch their fall um, collection, I always, always get, like, the whole collection because I love it so much. I love these to keep them one in my room and then one in the bathroom and then one in my other room. So I love to keep these because they are very, um, like they smell really good. This is new one from their fall collection and this is called Autumn Charm and it smells really good. You guys can smell them if you go into like Target or Walmart. I usually get the two packs and then I just really get a whole bunch and spray them all over. I do love candles and I am a candle lover, but right now I just, I'm too scared to burn them around my daughter because she will stick her finger in the fire, so, all right. Question numero dos is, what is your favorite fall lipstick? And this was a tough one because I have a lot of colors. You know, you guys know that I obviously don't like wearing fall colors during fall. I love to switch it up, but the color that I have been using a lot once the fall trend started is this one by ColourPop and this is in the color Limbo. It's like that perfect brown color. I love it and I love it because it's not too dark, but I don't know. It's just, it's perfect. It's a perfect dark lipstick and the color payoff on these are amazing. Not to mention that is a liquid lipstick. It's this one right here. This is such a pretty color. It is such a true brown color. It just really reminds me of the leaves and everything that is turning nice and like brown, all the leaves falling, things like that. So I would definitely have to say that color pop and the color limbo is my favorite fall lipstick. The next question is your favorite fa uh, favorite fall drink, and I would have to say. There's two that I just die for during these cold um, times. First, if you're Mexican, you are very familiar with atole. I love atole. It just reminds me so much of, you know, home when I was younger and I was in high school and my mom, she would wake up early with us and then before we got into the bus, she would make us atole or chocolate abuelita. Oh my god, it just brings so many memories. So I would definitely have to say atole and chocolate abuelita. Those are my favorite fall drinks. That sounds so good right now, actually. Alright, so the next question is, what is your favorite fall blush? Now, with this, I am going to be cheating just a little bit because I'm not the type of person that wears a specific color of blush because the time is changing. I really wear whatever blush I feel like it because it just all depends on the makeup that I'm wearing in my personal opinion. But I recently discovered some blushes which I will be reviewing for you guys. So if I had one blush for the rest of the fall, I would go with this. This is by the brand City Colors Cosmetics and this is their matte blush and this is in the color hibiscus this is such a gorgeous gorgeous blush it is i don't even know how to describe it usually people tend to go for really like mauvey blushes and i feel like this has a little bit of mauve in it it's this one right here and it is just the most gorgeous color it's the one that I'm wearing on my cheeks today. I don't even know if you can see it. I usually don't 
super pack on my blush but this is just the perfect blush because it gives you like a really like warm look to your face and I love it and it's inexpensive so the next question is what is your favorite um, fall clothing and I live in Utah so we get really cold here and we get tons of snow so I would have to say um, turtlenecks I love turtlenecks which I used to hate them but now I love them big sweaters or just big jackets um, some scarves really thick scarves which the past year my sister has been making me the cutest scarves um, and I love um, leather jackets even though they're not the warmest but they're so stylish for the fall I would definitely have to say um, leather jackets are just my favorite favorite fall movie you know what I'm gonna sound lame right now but I would definitely have to say is Hocus Pocus I've been I've been watching that movie all week my daughter loved it because she loves witches so I've been watching Hocus Pocus all this week and I just think it's such a classic movie it's so funny and it's it's a really good movie so yes I'm gonna have to go with Hocus Pocus the next question is favorite Thanksgiving food <sighs> oh lord so me being Mexican we make tons of food like we're gonna feed all our primos primas tios tias sobrinos your mom your mom's mom we're gonna feed everybody so we always make tons of food there's always food the next day you know el recalentado con tu cafecito and just eating everything but what i mainly love during thanksgiving i would have to say my I love mashed potatoes. I mean, I love mashed potatoes year-round. I can eat mashed potatoes and gravy. If that was my last meal, I would eat it. I love mashed potatoes, but I love, love, love the turkey that they make here. It's so good. El jamón with a piña. Oh my god, everything is so amazing. I really can't pinpoint down on one certain thing. And I also love when they make flan. Flan is my favorite dessert. So it's really hard because they make so much food, you know, like they make ponche and atole and um, chocolate. Oh my gosh, they just go crazy here in our family with food and they just, it's insane. But turkey definitely and uh, mashed potatoes with gravy just drizzle on the top and ah, just going right away. And then the last question is, what is your favorite Halloween costume? Now this this is gonna sound really probably lame to a lot of you guys but um, just a quick backstory my whole life since I was pretty much born I grew up in a Christian home um, my all my tias from my dad's side of the family they're all Christian um, so we just pretty much grew up in a Christian home if you're a Christian you know that we don't celebrate Halloween I've never celebrated Halloween um, well, I actually think I did once when I was younger. Um, I think we did it after, like years after my dad passed away. I remember I dressed up as a ghost, um, and then the year before, and then the year after that, I don't think I celebrated Halloween um, until I was like way, way, way older. But I would say that my favorite Halloween costume from the times that I have celebrated, celebrated it celebrate it would have to be when I did it about three years ago I believe um, it was nothing that I bought or anything it was just pretty much a DIY I dressed up as a pinup girl I just wore some like really high-waisted shorts with some nude heels and then it was a striped white and blue shirt I, I uh, did like a really thick eyeliner with a little Lunat here and then um, red lipstick and then you know the whole pinup hair which my sister did for me with the big old rose here it was so fun like I had so much fun that day I went out with a really good friend of mine and we just went partying like locas so that was really fun that was the last um, that was the last year that I celebrated Halloween and I loved it. It was it was pretty fun. So that is all for the fall favorites tag. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know that I had 
maybe some boring answers to this question but you guys wanted to see this video as well so I hope I somehow entertain you guys I also wanted to let you know that I have been vlogging um, it might be a hot mess because I've never vlogged before so whenever I put it up just please be nice so that is everything for today's video thank you guys so much for watching as always leave me comments and let me know what other videos you guys would like to see next and that is everything. Again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video.